So you know your situation is 100% different than this one. I do you have the number towards that, but and there's there's hope. Good. Yeah. I have this very kind of special relationship with Caleb in a way that I think is only cultivated going through the kind of trauma that we experience on Lulu. But you have the numbers. You, me. So I'm feeling really sad about lying to Caleb. You were good. Yeah. So I'm so excited. It's hard, but I myself, as this kind of lone remaining Lulu player with Caleb, realize that if I'm sticking my neck out on the line for him too much, then that shifts the target from him onto me, and I can't have that happen. So I resigned myself to letting Caleb go. You think Caleb want to work with you right now? Yes. Yeah, totally. Okay. I feel kind of bad about it because yes. I think I'm the only person here he really kind of trusts. Yeah. So my game plan right now is to really re-solidify the alliances that I had with Drew and Austin that we cultivated when I was on the new Bello tribe. But I mean, if Kelly goes and you have an idol. Yeah, but I don't need her to go too because that also will put another target in me because it's like right now I don't have anything. Yeah, yeah. I think everyone knows now with Jay gone, instead of a three-way shared extra vote, I'm gonna have a two-way shared steal vote with Kelly. But one piece of information that only I know, and I guess maybe Drew, but I don't even know if you put the pieces together yet, Caleb only stopped 11 votes instead of 12 because I didn't vote for him. Bummer, I'm not gonna vote. Instead of voting, I'm gonna be sacrificing it in order to extend this to a fully fledged idol. Finally, I have a regular idol. It is fully active until the final five. After all this work, it took 13 days for it to get there, and I have it now. My idol has reached its final form, and I could be the most powerful person on this island with one of the best shots here to win this game.